everybody so today I'm going to do a homecoming makeup look tutorial and before I get started I just wanted to give a shout out to my best friend and you know who you are and I really miss you right now so shout out to you and well let's get started <laughs> taking an astringent and apply it all over the face make sure to fan dry before the next step taking a firming serum and apply it all over the face and neck taking moisturizer and putting it on the face and neck as well. Make sure to blend in well because you don't want your foundation being too oily and watery because of this. Apply a primer all over the face and the neck to make it blend down and so you get that flawless look. We're taking a yellow concealer, apply it under the eyes. And the green concealer and apply on zits, redness around the nose, hyperpigmentation, all of that. But don't make yourself look like a witch. Take your foundation brush, blending all that in. Now taking a matte mousse foundation. Getting just the color with your fingers first and applying that all over the face. Then you can go back with a foundation brush and just apply more if you need to. Then taking concealer, apply and anywhere you missed under your eyes, unzip. You want your face to be flawless. Take foundation brush and just blend it in. Use the warmth of your hands to blend in the product. This will make sure you have a flawless face. Now using a powder brush and a matte powder, apply all over the face. This will set the makeup. Using a big fluffy face brush, just blend that in. Using a bronzing brush, and a matte bronzer. Tap off the excess and contour the face. Under the cheekbones, sides of the nose, the temples, the jawline. Blend that in with a big fluffy brush using the contour and blush and bronzing palette in a darker brown contour anywhere that you want just a deeper contour and blend that out with a fluffy brush again I'm taking a stipple brush and a cream brush just apply on the cheeks now taking clear's palette and using a peach blush right there Tap up the extras. And now using a bubblegum pink. This will help set it too. Now taking a big stipple brush, a sash highlighting brush, and a highlighter. Apply to the high points of the face. Now blending that out again. See how there's a jawline there and the and blend some extra matte bronzer down your neck and contour the decollete. Now highlight the decollete. Using another bronzer, but this one is very shimmery. Apply with a big fluffy brush everywhere that you want to sparkle. Using a setting powder, this one's very fine. Apply all over the face so that your makeup won't get into those little creases like the forehead and the dimples of your face. Then using lip balm, apply the lip. And now onto the eyes. Using an eye base, apply all over the eyes. 
butt in with your ring fingers all the way up to the brow bone and the inner corner too. Now taking a pink color face and apply all over the eyelids. Don't blend in all the way. We want the eyeshadow to stick to this. Taking a stiff eyeshadow brush and a pink color, apply over the eyelids. Taking a normal eyeshadow brush and a earthy taupe color, apply it to the outer corners. Now taking a contour brush and a dark brown color, the cool undertone. Apply to the outer corner and a little into the crease. Now using a blending brush, just blend that out. Using a blending brush again and a darker brown to find the outer corner, and you can use a card. I'm using an ID card that I don't use anymore. And just blend out with a blending brush. Blend any harsh edges. Now taking your earthy top and blending out the harsh edges on the outside to make it smoky. Now taking a top color and just blending even more, taking a smudge brush and the darkest brown that we've used, line the lower lash line, make a smoky eye, blend with a blending brush. Now taking the champagne color and the sponge applicator that's included with it. Highlight your brow bone and blend with a branding brush. Now taking the linen color, which is a white color, and highlight the brow bone, the inner corner, and center of the lid. Now taking a white color again, champagne color, and highlight the inner corners. Gotcha. Blending. Taking a stiff eyeshadow brush and the pink again, layering it on top. Blending. Now the white color again, and blending that with a smaller brush in the white color and the inner. Corners and the pink layered over top again. The stiff brush. Taking a super sparkly eyeshadow and a sponge, put on the inner corners to make really make your eyes pop. Blend with a white eyeliner. Line your lower waterline. This will make your eyes look bigger. And with a flat eyeliner brush, but first comb your brow bone and do your eyebrows. Now, lining your lower lash line. But first, let's finish that. And with a black eyeliner, line your upper lash line. Set it with the black color. With a gel eyeliner, line your lash line, wing out the ends.
fabulous selfie. Nailed it! What's an eyelash curler? Curl the lashes. Taking a waterproof mascara. And using the bigger one to coat the upper lashes and taking the shadow shield and it makes it easier and clump free to clump through your lashes. And now taking a comb and going through them. Now doing the lower lashes and combing through them again. Now with a lip balm, apply to the lips, the nude lip liner, apply on the outside and then fill in. I nude lipstick and a bubblegum pink lip gloss. I hope you enjoyed watching my video. Please don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe and check out my channel. I'm really sorry for the quality of this video, but it was a really long video and I didn't have a lot of time to edit and get it up. So, see you next time, guys. Bye!